All right, today I'm going to give you guys a detailed look at this Target exclusive Transformer Autobot and I mean uh, Optimus Prime and Autobot Bullseye. And this is again Target exclusive. Nice packaging, red and white. And uh, there's the back of the box. Oh, it's 40 year Transformer already. So, yeah. So, let's get into it. All right, so let's open up uh, Optimus Prime here. Let's see which side should I open. I tend to open the uh, this side more, the right side. When it comes to figures, I don't know why, but I, but I do. I just do. So yeah. So here it is. There's the truck. And there's a lot of ties here, so I'm gonna cut them all off. All right, and there we go. The truck. Now, so oops, let's take a look at the, the truck without the hauler first. So, that's a pretty good truck, actually. Is this what a target truck looks like? I'm not 100% sure. And there's the trailer. This looks like the uh. Yeah, it's definitely the Optimus Prime trailer. There we go, right there. It's got Bullseye right here. Target logo. Kind of cool, actually. I do like this. And let me put this down. This should be able to open up. Oh, let's open it this way then. There we go. And then inside here, got this with articulated arm. Well, with the arm, not articulated. And then on the bottom, I think there's a lever right here. Stabilize him right there. Let's turn this down so you guys can see it. It's too bright. This is just a repaint. The hauler is just a repaint of another version I've seen before. And then here's a little bow's eye right there. All right, so let us take one last look before I transform him. Let's see how complicated he is to transform. Hopefully he's not too complicated, but one last look. Oh, you know what? Let me get a photo first. All right, so let's start transforming him. So push this out, push this out. And then the feet are supposed to go up like that. And then I'm supposed to straighten him up. The arm's supposed to come down. I'll go up like so. And what do I do? Oh, oh, I'm supposed to detach this section up like that. And then twist the legs 180 degrees. Yes, I could push these. Nope. And then uh, what am I seeing? Turn this 180 degrees. I'm supposed to split the top portion in half. Well, this way, I guess. Pushing this down, I think. Pushing this down a little bit and then upward like that. I'm supposed to flip this portion out. Oh, something fell. What the hell? Oh, Matrix Leadership. The Matrix is red on this one. Ooh, interesting. So I'll flip that out and then there's another piece I'm supposed to flip out. And this whole piece is supposed to come out. Open this portion out somehow. What exactly are you showing me? What? Uh, what? Okay, there we go. Then put that out. Then I guess get the arms out, right? Then also get the head out. And I'm 
supposed to get these out too. How am I gonna get this out? There we go. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. There. Stand those up. Oops. We'll close these back up. Okay, there's a slot here for it. I guess this comes down like that to be his chest. The arms, let's see, that's his shoulder. This is supposed to click in over here. Let me see here. Is it? I would think so, right? Let's rotate 180 degrees, open this up to reveal his hand, pull this out, close this back up. Why is this not clicking in? Is this supposed to click in? I don't understand. get these hands out first. Oh, there we go. Okay. So it is right, I guess, like that. Mm -hmm. Just forcing it in there. What is up with his arms? They look so puny. Look at how puny his arms are. Is that how it's supposed to be? Hey, why is he with no weapons? Why does he come with no weapons? Where's his... Where's his, uh, um, rifle? He does not come with a rifle? So it looks like that might be it. I'm not sure. Yeah, it looks like I have it. Done already. Supposed to click in somewhere? Click, click, click. I don't hear it clicking. It comes down. I keep saying I'm supposed to push it down. There's no way I could push it down. Whatever. I'm just gonna leave it like that then. Okay, so. Looks like Optimus Prime is done. Let me put the matrix back in here. So we can open this up and then put the matrix back in here. So there's him with the matrix right there. Close this up. Optimus Prime. He looks like Nemesis Prime mode and Optimus Prime here with that color scheme. But uh, yeah, looks like that's it. All right, so here's Optimus Prime with his uh, puny arms, and uh, let's go for articulation real quick then. Yeah, the arms, uh, if you move the shoulder, whatever these things are, out of the way, then uh, you could kind of get them to move all the way around, but you will have to move those out of the way. Head movements on the ball joint, but... Uh, Mm, I think it's okay. Okay range. Then uh, as far as the torso is concerned. Swivel. That's it. The legs. Wow, he has a tiny torso. Look at this. Look at how tiny this torso is. How Look at how long the legs are. In comparison. 90 degrees. A little past 90. The legs can swing out. Rotate. Then this one could pivot left and right, and that's it. Yeah. Still a decent looking Optimus. But uh, it's lacking a rifle, of course. But I guess this is target uh, version of Optimus, so he's not, he's not killing anyone. He's a friendly Optimus who likes to play with his dog. 
So let's get a closer look at them. Definitely looks like evil Optimus Prime. But I must say he does look cool in this uh, design here. I think it's based on another another Transformer Auto, uh, another Optimus Prime uh, from a while back. Yeah. Really nice. Not a whole lot of holes everywhere. I mean the arms are really nice. I like it. Everything's all covered up. That's good. Then yeah, there's just not a whole lot of holes everywhere. The legs are nicely covered up. I like that. I know these can open, but are they supposed to just come out like this? I guess. Not sure. Let's see. Oh shit. Just popped it right off. Excuse me, my language. Pulled it a little too hard. There we go. Should be gentle with my toys. But yeah, from the uh, promotional uh, pics, I've noticed these arms change colors. Uh, these are supposed to be grayish color on the promo pics. But uh, the final version is red. Still very cool. So let me... Oh, too bright, too bright. Let me do a comparison with other Transformers here. We have Primal by next them. And then Shockwave. That's how tall he is next to them. And yeah. Pretty cool. Uh, I think this is Target exclusive for 50 bucks. Oh, these most come down. <laughs> yeah, for 50 bucks. And uh, yeah, it's decent. It's okay. Uh, I'm happy with it. And um, all these. Oh, there we go. It's supposed to come down all the way. And what are these supposed to Oh, look at that. The rockets up here. So he does have weapons. Okay, so that's cool right there. Come down, and then what else can he do? That's about it. Yeah. So it's nice. I do like it, but uh, I wish he came with a rifle or something. Uh, okay, Primo is going to give him some weapons. Primo is going to give him two swords right there. Now he's cool. Now he's ready to attack. Whoa. There he is, Optimus. The killer, Optimus. Yeah, he does look like a Nemesis Prime. He's more of a Nemesis Prime looking than Optimus Prime because of the colors. Uh, I think eventually, I wonder if they'll do a purple version of him. But probably not Target exclusive. Not, not a Target truck anymore. But uh, yeah, it's kind of cool to have an Optimus Prime in a Target vehicle. So yeah. Let me see what else can he do. Not much. So, yeah, I'll have him sit on the trailer right here. So, just chilling with his dog. Chilling with his puppy right here. Chilling like a villain. Now, let's get his head. Oh, no head movement. Okay. It's kind of like that then. Okay, so there you go. There's uh, the Target exclusive Optimus Prime from Target. And uh, by Hasbro. Thanks for watching.